Was Dale Gribble aware that Joseph was John Redcorn's son? Everyone else was certainly aware, and it would be pretty difficult to not figure it out. However, Dale is ignorant to the fact throughout the entirety of King of the Hill's run. Or was he feigning that ignorance? Some fans believe that Dale was only pretending to not know that Nancy was cheating on him, and he was actually silently aware the whole time. But why would he do this? One theory suggests that once Joseph was born, Dale realized that the best thing he could do to get revenge on John Redcorn would be to prevent him from raising his own son. By staying in the picture and acting as though he believed that Joseph was really his son, he put a lot of extra stress on Nancy to not be outed as a cheater now that she had a family, and a lot of extra stress on John Redcorn, because all he could do was sit and watch as his son was raised by another man. By the time John Redcorn reaches out and tries to speak to his son, he had only been raised with different enough values, and was so unfamiliar with him to the point that he didn't really want to associate with him, and that definitely hurt John Redcorn. It's, in every sense of the word, a really unconventional version of revenge, and the theory is a little far-fetched, but not more far-fetched than Dale being out of the loop this entire time.